Hello, my beautiful people. This is Sylvia Giza. Hold on one second. I hope you can hear me very good. Very good. Uh, so it's uh, actually late here. It's 10.44. So I'm kind of got uh, the voice kind of like a little bit quiet. Uh, but I love nights, you know. The night, in, it's my the best, the best... Uh, uh, time in the day <laughs> so how are you guys doing i actually like uh, kind of like this kind of video i'm doing so i don't have to show my face but i want to give you the information and i w this uh, information is actually very important so uh, and i maybe if you can you can spread this information because it's very important you know so i was driving yesterday and this is third time ca third time happens you know and nobody was on the streets and only uh, only uh, police cars uh, car start to driving after me and of course i have in my car this uh, this metal uh, like a uh, for the window, for the front window when there's the sun, you got this metal things, like a sheet, you know what I mean? And then you cover the window so the sun is not coming to your uh, car, right? So I had this actually on my seat because this is metal thing. So I figured out maybe I will put this on my seat, on my car. So whoever is going to be driving with this radiation thing, it's not going to actually hit me, okay? So police car was driving yesterday after me, like maybe, I don't know, for like two minutes or something, you know? And they actually still, even with this metal thing, metal shield, they still actually radiate me in my back and they radiate me in the place where is the pancreas, okay? So, every time the police is driving after you, it's they have this uh, radiation system uh, which they actually checking uh, your speed limit. And this thing actually is radiating your body, okay? So, sometimes you can feel not good the next day or you got all kinds of symptoms. Like, for example, I had this three times happen to me. Uh, and then every every time I actually the next day I was in the doctor's office okay and I got some kind of like you know problem with my body and it's connected to my pancreas okay so uh, the police cars they have some kind of technology which they are not healthy for our body okay so this is message right now this message is for the city of uh, Presco, the city of other cities, you know what I mean? The ca uh, actually, who is responsible for that? So let me see. Uh, you need to talk to the city about this, guys, because uh, the city approves everything, right? So the police people, they have no voice over that. You have to go to the city and tell the city that you don't want it, okay? Because this thing is actually radiating your body. So when this thing is radiating to your body, it's actually connected to the pancreas, which is actually blocking your aura, which is actually uh, blocking your aura, which is your nervous system, okay? So for example, your nervous system and your aura is big, right? And when they driving after you, okay, they check your speed limit and in the same moment they try to, they radiate to your body okay and then later you got black blockage on your aura which is your nervous system parasympathetic sympathetic nervous system which is outside of your body and it's inside of your body okay so you got this system outside and inside of your body okay so when this block is on your body on your aura then all kinds of sickness start to happen, okay? This is also connected to your T, because it's all connected to your T too. And then uh, it's connected, actually later you get all kinds of sickness, and all kinds of sickness, which is like a large amount of people starts to be sick on thyroid. And this is connected to the pancreas, right? 
So thyroid problems, diabetes problems, okay, uh, anxiety problems, okay, and all kinds of uh, immu autoimmune systems problems because when the body is radiate through this radiation, the black it's inside the body where is pancreas. So black the pancreas, okay. So when the pancreas are blocked, okay, then the other body's uh, organs cannot work properly, okay. And then the problem starts, okay? So this is what I see from my spirit, from my Kundalini, how this looks inside, okay? So that's why I want to share with you. So you know that because you probably driving the cars and you're doing all kinds of things in the daytime and you have no idea that these things happen, you know? And then later you feel sick, you feel tired the next day and you can have to rest like two, three days in the bed, for example, you know what I mean? And when I go to the Facebook, for example, ascension symptoms, and I see all those people, they have as ascension symptoms. Some of those, like 80% of those ascension symptoms are the symptoms from cell towers and the symptoms from the radiation from the police cars, okay? So, and the third one is the your T, your T. So there is three things, which is the most important. Your tea has to be balanced, dental proprioception. Then you got uh, police cars radiating you. And then you got cell towers, which is actually sending the wave frequency to your brain and blocking your brain. So you got a blockage on your brain. And this is also connected, not sending proper si signals later to your body. You know what I mean? Because it's actually creating the little chips in your head. Okay. So, and you can take this off, you can take everything off from your body, from your aura, but you need time to do it. So what's the point to do it? Go to outside to the city, go to war, go to uh, do all kinds of stuff, for example, like you got hit with this radiation and you have to heal your body all the time. Because otherwise you will not have to do it, you know what I mean? Because you will feel good. Like, for example, I went yesterday to the city and I felt great, right? And then I was driving, driving, and then they just hit me.